Bioshock is rated M by the ESRB. Hello and welcome back to more Steven Plays Bioshock. In the last episode, to my knowledge, we have fully completed Fort Frolic. Which is exciting. We got everything there is to get, at least, you know, from what I think. Uh, this is the second to last episode in our, our recording batch, so if there's anything that I need to know, let me know in the comments of this video, um, because that is uh, the last thing I will be looking at before I record the next batch. So, Fort Frolic is probably dead. Dead? I said, I meant to say done, but I said dead. But yeah, dead too, because everyone in there is dead. So now, we get to go to Hephaestus. And what will we, what will face us in Hephaestus? I guess we'll find out shortly. Okay. Name is okay. We gotta please stand by, whatever that's for. Watch yourself. Ryan's stirring. We best keep to our knitting. It's time to either run the table or go home empty. Ryan's got the genetic key to Rapture. We get that from him and we get out of this hell hole. We don't, then you and I are ghosts. Now would you kindly head to Ryan's office and kill the son of a bitch? It's time to finish this. Gracious. Maybe we're almost done. <laughs> I say Cohen's lost his touch, if you knew him when, when he used to believe in the work, in the struggle. And now, he rots in that Neverland, waiting for someone to come and tell him he still got it. I suppose that's why he let you live. Thanks, Andrew Ryan. You're a pal. Three dollars! Oh boy! Great Jiminy Christmas! Anything in any, any of the stuff? For that special gift. Burgers of value. I'm pretty set on stuff right now. Uh, I'm not really concerned. I have a lot of ammunition for various weapons. Not really sure what I'm getting myself into, left or right. I hear enemies. Question is, are they coming my way? Like, they're, they, they, it's sound, the sound design in this game is fantastic. It sounds like they're right next to me. There's a dead person. I'm creepy laughing. Shotgun. Gladly take more ammo any time of day, man. Eat corpse and die. Oh, he lost me. That is funny. Here, buckaroo. Oh, God. Still alive? Holy crap. Wow, that, that took a lot more uh, ammo than I was thinking it would need. That was effective. Okay. This gun's not so bad. These are scary dudes, man. Scary, scary dudes. Did these both go to the same place? Got a random hat here. I think these both went around to the same thing. It's like a rock in the way, so they just build around it both ways. It's nice. It's very nice design. Also, this part of the, the place is not leaking. A lot of earlier parts of Rapture were leaking pretty badly. Ryan Industries. This is creepy, man. This is really creepy. You can taste it, can't you? Andrew Ryan. Um, yeah. I can taste Andrew Ryan. Someone's coming. But from where? Right there. Just a child. 
Wow, she can't get past me. But she doesn't suspect that anyone is here. That's pretty funny. Might be a good chance to do this. It's a good weapon. Um, glad I have a lot of ammo for it. Chemical thrower. Already got one of those, pal. You are shaken, and also you're very bloody. Switch back over to this. No, 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 no. I said no. There we go. So that'll help a little bit. Um, gonna have to get under this. Are those frag grenades? Because those look like frag grenades, and they are, and I would love them. Ryan, nationalized full-time futuristics. He owns it now, lock, stock, and barrel. For the good of the sea, he says. He'll break it up in due time, he says. I've resigned from the council and lodged me letter of protest, but God, that's just pissing in the wind. It'll be war, I say, unless somebody stops Ryan and ride fast. Okay, Office of Andrew Ryan and a gene bank. We've got some controls that don't do anything. Gene banks are fine. This is it, baby. Someone's here. But they're not they're not moving fast enough, so we're going. Let's go. Do I have any anti-person? Yeah, a few. I think I'll stick to the normal ones. If I keep my distance, I should be fine. Glue. There actually doesn't really seem to be anyone in here. I spent the afternoon trying to get as close to Ryan's gate as possible without making a spectacle of myself. He's got a chair at six ways to Easter. There's no way into that place. All I got for my trouble was the hairy eyeball from Ryan's splicer mates. Oh. What's the reward you get for trying to outsmart the best electrical engineer of our generation? I think maybe having the electric flesh tonic, which uh, is something I, I just put on, was probably a good idea. Sounds like there's going to be a lot of electricity. We have Eve Hypo. Quarter can of ionic gel. Don't really know what that's about. Ah, a present. <laughs> You like, yes. Creepy. Very creepy. Invisible? <laughs> I'm invisible. That was great. I knew that if I waited to be invisible before I started grabbing that stuff, I'd be in good shape. So you gave me a lot of free equipment and I appreciate it. You're very... Very nice lady. Are they still here? Can't really tell. The ceiling is dark. I don't know if they'll just eventually give up and go away or not. Yeah, let's do Exploding Buck. I don't think I've even used it the entire game. And maybe some fire. Let's make stuff happen. Kaboom! That's a big fire. Okay, but actually they did leave. They're not even here anymore. Well, okay, never mind. I'm just gonna walk around. I got exploding buck. I'm actually actively waiting at this point for them to just show up. There you go. Exploding buck works quite well. Yeah, this is nice. I can't carry any more automatic hack tools. That's unusual. Okay, so there's a camera over there. Alright, I think I might be able to get away with normal buck, to be honest. Alright! Things are good! Yeah, I can use normal buck. 
Okay, so I've killed a few guys. Got my gun reloaded. Things are well. No, no, no. No, no. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, hack. Let's go ahead and hack this thing out of existence. Um, let's go straight. Yeah, it's like a secret shortcut, sort of. Um, there's like no pieces that are going the way I need them to go. Uh, straight? Are there no more straight pieces? Where's... Where's the... This. My god. That was hard. That was hard to find, darn it. Some of the people are probably laughing at me, but that was hard. It was hard to locate. My vision was not... Was not cooperating there. We got the U invent. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. I don't know how much Electric Joe I have. Um, but enough. I think I have enough. Um, all right, keep on rocking in the free world. Let's do it. Health station. I'm good. A worm looks up and sees the face of God. But look around. It's a regular convention of worms in here. They all had mothers, fathers, people who loved them. They got married, not their wives. What makes you think you're any different? I haven't chosen the spot for you on the wall yet. Let me know if you have a preference. Stopping Ryan. I never killed a man, let alone a mason. But this is what things come to. I don't know if killing Mr. Ryan will stop the war. But I know it won't stop while that man breathes. I love Mr. Ryan. Well, I love Ratchet. If I have to kill one to save the other, so be it. Part of me was kind of hoping they'd all have stories. But uh, that's the guy that we've heard of from in, in many things already. Cigarettes. Didn't really want those, but I took them anyway. A battery! I had to go jungle style with that filthy ape for three weeks, but he finally spilled the beans on how to get to Andrew Ryan. Generate a sympathetic overload in harmonic core number three. That simple. Now all I gotta do is figure out what the hell a sympathetic overload is, and for that matter, a harmonic core number three. Piece of cake for an electrical engineer. Too bad I designed lady's shoes. I'm gonna go see the grease monkeys left alive in heat loss monitoring. See what I can shake out of their trees. We got some information. I like all parasites who ever tried to walk in stolen shoes. I'd explain the science that renders what you're trying to do impossible, but that would be like playing Mozart for a tree frog. <laughs> so it looks like. Being invisible is so helpful, my god. Because they don't actually know where I am, and that's pretty cool. It gives me time to think. Plan my plan my actions, like do I want to use Insect Swarm? Possibly. I don't know. No, I didn't need to use the health kit yet. But I couldn't tell, because I was so anxious. Dude, this guy's tough. Where'd you go? My god! What is that thing? Rapture is coming back to life. Even now, can't you hear the breath returning to her lungs? The shops reopening, the schools humming with the thoughts of young minds. My city will live! My city will thrive! And when that day comes, Use your tombstone for pavement tiles. <laughs> so it's telling me not to pull this thing? Okay. But we can go to the core, so I guess that's where we're going. We were wrong. Nothing ever works anymore. God damn it. 
This could be fun. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. And I will kill them all with the weapon of my choice, which is this gun. Darn it. Seriously, the leadhead splicers got scary good. I think I killed him, though. Like, wow. Wow, they got good. Um, I think I'm gonna be fine, but I'm gonna have to stick more to the shotgun. The shotgun does enough damage to actually do some stuff, but the big ones, the big leadheads, like the ones in the crazy jackets? They're nuts. Brass tubing. Uh, is there anything else around here? I didn't even see that, but it came up on my screen, so I hit E. Anything else around? I want to say I want to, you know, keep checking the ceiling, so I think we're good here. Continue forward. I don't know what's around the corners here, but I'm ready. Alright, here goes the core. The corpse. God. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's still big daddies and little sisters. Crap, there are three. Well this... It's gonna get... A little rough. So that guy got hurt. Is the, the the little girl's on his back? Oh my god! Go get him! Do not know if that was wise or not, but I did it. Did they get him? Did they do it? God, I'm freaked out. Where did they go? Oh, he is pissed at me. I wasn't sure, but now I am. <laughs> oh my god, he is raging. You got some rage there, buddy, that you should probably work out. Also, I meant to take your photo, but I forgot. But you know what? For you, I will make an exception and kill you first. I'm pretty sure I'm in the middle of combat, but I'm going to rescue you regardless, and hopefully I won't get hurt. Oh my god, that was a little stressful. Sorry, I gotta get these photos. Because uh, I did not get them. Okay, photos gotten. Not gonna do as well on the bouncer research uh, after the fact. Oh, God. Are you seriously not dead? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to buy some first aid after this. So things have gotten a little extreme. Okay. The subject is dead, so that's not gonna do really great for my research. But there will be more bouncers. Oh, I can't do them any- <sighs> I really didn't get very much research at all out of that then, did I? Alright, um, quarter can of ionic gel, da da da. This is, uh, this is a very scary place. Fortunately, there's still coffee on the ground, and that's something I can get behind, but otherwise, uh, very, very scary place. One of, uh, one of three little sisters has been saved, and that's always one of my least favorite things to deal with, is, is, uh, fighting off the Big Daddy, especially now that they're crazy, crazy scary. There's more guys up here. That's convenient. Yes, I will gladly take more pictures of you. Thank you. There was an extra one, and I'm all like, yeah, photo, 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 photo. 
Okay, um, cool. They gave me a gift. And there's also a tape. An assassin. Oh, that's rich. I could have gone along, I suppose. Spliced up. Forgot. I believed in this place. I believed in Ryan. But when it got hard, Ryan didn't believe in rapture. Didn't believe in the great chain. He believed in power. And now this place is Busto. And my girl is... Gone. Worse than gone. One of those things. So am I an assassin? Well, only one way to find out. Ouch. All right, let's go ahead and grab this uh, shotgun. Oh, a power to the people state. Hello, that's wacky. It's like just sitting here doing nothing. Ah, uh, pistol damage increase could be fun. Don't care about kickback. Don't care about rate of fire, really. It increases the rate of fire, but it doesn't make the clip longer, which is what I would be more interested in. Uh, immunity has never been a big issue. Chemical throw or range could be, but I'd probably not. Breakage chance, damage increase. Um, these have been doing really good already. I'm going to go for pistol. I think I'm going to go for pistol damage increase. And then the next one will be damage increase for the crossbow. And we'll see what happens there. And we got some pretty good stuff. Um, although we can't carry any more Evipo and we can't carry any more proximity mines. And that makes me really sad. But we have 500 Atom, which is a ridiculous amount. We can do all sorts of things. We can get another health upgrade. Should probably go ahead and grab the Eve upgrade because why not? Uh, Winter Blast 2, Insect Swarm 2, Cyclone... Some of you guys were telling me that soon we'll be we'll have access to um we'll have access to the level three stuff. Electro Bolt three, baby, it's right here. So I could swap that out for my Electro Bolt um and maybe see I don't know if there's an incinerate three, but Electro Bolt three, is that good? I don't know. You can let me know. Uh, like I said before, this is going to be the last episode before a um before this is the last episode that you guys can respond to that I will see before I record another batch, is what I'm trying to say. So, thank you for watching. Let me know what I need to know for the upcoming stuff. And uh, I'll see you guys next time for more Steven Plays Bioshock. I begged Mr. Ryan to hand Fontaine's futuristics over to Atlas's boys as a peace offering. But the stupid sod won't listen to reason. Instead, he's just splicing his mob up. Giving them more and tougher plasmids. There's an arms race on here, in Rapture. But it's not about who can build the best guns and the biggest bombs. It's about who can become less of a man and more of a monster.